Hello everyone and welcome to your ch our channel. Welcome to this um, Throne Room Tuesday where basically I put something in the throne room to listen to your prayers. And so, okay, today I feel like there's some aspirations, some goals that I have. However, I feel like those things are being stunted and it's all my fault. Sometimes I feel like we need to take responsibility where we should. And so... While I know that in order for it to be my fault, that I must be cooperating with Satan. So stand by so you can find out what I'm doing, what's going on. So, okay, my name is Sheila Rollins, and I am the founder of Sheila Ministries Entertainment and Associates, Inc. And on this year, too, we are Overcomers Anonymous. We support anyone designed to overcome anything. And we do it with Jesus Christ being a higher power and also what he's accomplished for us on the cross. Therefore, our completeness, our wholeness, our cleanliness, those things that we thought were impossible becomes possible with Jesus Christ. But in order for us to get all of what he has for us, we need to be obedient to his word. And I encourage the, Ten, the uh, King James Version and also the Ten Commandments, including the Fourth Commandment, where he admonishes us to keep the Seventh-day Sabbath. These things are binding on us for eternal life, and that's in the description check that out. If you want to comment, scroll down below and make a comment. And then also, if you haven't already become a part of the YouTube family, we would love to have you. Okay. So don't delay. Come on and stay. So, okay. And also while you um, add it, please share the video, share everywhere with everyone, including those on all social media platform, um, and cover subscription as you share. And please give me some thumbs up for anything that you see, anything you like, anything you hear. Um, you can give me a topic in the comment section if you like. You know, check out the other YouTube, the Pursuit to Christ, and the playlist on both YouTubes. It's a lot there. Okay, so check it out. So, okay, so tell me if these comments feel or, or sound familiar to you. Okay. Um, I'm too tired. Uh, I don't feel like exerting that much energy. I'm not disciplined enough. <sighs> I'm so tired. I don't feel like it. I don't want to. I'm too busy. I don't have time. Okay. So if that sounds familiar to you, and if you cooperate with that, then you kind of know what I'm experiencing. So I know that as I look around, especially like in my house, um, I see things that I've neglected. Um, I know that I've been tied up. My daughter's been sick. I've, been, I've had death in the family a few times and that kind of thing. But still, these are the comments that I have repeatedly rehearsed to myself. And so I feel like beneath all of that, because my inspiration, my aspirations, my goals have not been met, they've been retarded, okay? There's been a delay in my progress. I know that I'm cooperating with Satan. So what am I asking for prayer for? I'm asking you to pray, pray for me so that I can cooperate with God cooperate with Christ so that instead of feeling down because I didn't meet my goals, I can feel great. I can feel wonderful. I can feel proud, humbly proud because I cooperated with God and I've met my aspirations. My goals have been fulfilled. That even sounds better. Okay. So that is what I want you to pray for me with on this throne room Tuesday. Comment down below whatever it is that you want me to pray for you with, okay? So, believe it or not, your prayers have helped me a lot, and I'm hoping that my prayers have really, really helped you. This about our celebration. We're still celebrating um, eight years for the nonprofit, two years for Shula Ministries Overcomers and Anonymous um, YouTube, the Pursuit to Christ, one year. I think it's three years for the food fundraiser, which is Shiloh's Gorilla's Garden of Eating. Three years for that. Secret ministries where people can contact me and 
you know, talk and, you know, get some guidelines or maybe just prayer, encouragement or whatever. Um, so it's about eight years for that as well. So, okay. So basically that's all I have for you. We just need to remember that we can do all things through Christ, which strengthens us. And if you have goals of like educational goals, spiritual goals, um, exercising goals, food goals, like, you know, you're going to work on eating better, say November the 15th. Okay. Whatever those goals are, let us commit those things to Christ and ask for his help so that we can meet those goals. It's possible. It's doable. Believe it. Okay. We need not complain or keep on cooperating with Satan and get nowhere. Okay. We need to cooperate with God and feel like we're doing something. And no, because we'll be able to turn around and look to see what we've achieved. So be encouraged. Be encouraged. This is all I have for you. Now unto him that is able to keep you from falling and to present you faultless before the presence of his glory with exceeding joy. To the only wise God, our, our Savior, be glory and majesty, dominion and power, both now and ever. I love you. See you in the next YouTube.